All new tonight, it's been a tough year for one Charlotte family. Kendall Crank was killed in crossfire while driving to work back in March, an innocent victim's life taken too soon. Her family, still coping with the loss, received some joy today, all in the spirit of giving. NBC Charlotte's Michelle Bowden tells us how one organization stepped up to help in wake of this terrible loss. Linda Springs has shed a lot of tears this year. One day I had her and, and then she's taken away from me. But she wants people to know today's tears are tears of joy. I, I was just overwhelmed, uh, just happy. Um, tears just started flowing and they are tears of joy. And uh, I'm just so grateful, so, so grateful. <laughs> Grateful after strangers knocked on her door this morning with presents for her and her grandkids. Joy, tears just started flowing and um, I had no idea it was going to be anything to this extent. Springs buried her daughter, Kendall Crank, in March. She was on her way to school and she happened to drive through a, a shootout. The 27-year-old mother of two is one of 106 people murdered in Charlotte in one of the city's deadliest years on record. So many families, uh, we're all going through this together. She says the community support has been a powerful part of her healing. Everyone just embrace the death of my daughter and my family, embrace my family. It was so saddened to hear the news and um, wish that I could do more to hear about a family not being able to be together for Christmas um, when I'm able to to be with my family, um, I wish that there was more that I could do. This is tremendous that you guys can come and, and lift my and lift our family up. Well, I believe in miracles, and uh, this is one a miracle for me and my family. In Charlotte, Michelle Bowden, NBC Charlotte.